signing day. It's, it's a little bit different for you guys because you don't have football scholarships. How is it different from a, a different school? Well, we have tried to create our signing day exactly like we would have created it when I was at Furman. However, uh, because uh, we're a non-athletic aid school, we cannot announce our signing class until they pay their deposit. We're probably going to sign somewhere in, in the neighborhood of 21 to 24 tomorrow on signing day, uh, and then we'll be able to add some more as we go down the list. When you're recruiting a student to come here, how do you sell them on a program that's never played a game? Well, I, I think the number one sale here is, is academics. Uh, Mercer's proud tr tradition and history of academics is known throughout the state of Georgia. And when we go out in the state, they know about Mercer Law, they know about Mercer Engineering, they know about Mercer Medicine. Academics, number one. Number two, we built a unbelievable facility here. And I think uh, this facility has been wowed by every student athlete has been on campus, even a lot of the high school coaches that have come by. It's number three. The ability to play Division One FCS football right here in the middle of the state of Georgia. And then number four is probably one of the most key elements is playing time. These young men can come in literally, if they're good enough, they start next year and could possibly be a four-year starter. And as we know, all 18-year-olds, they, all they want to do is play. And so we're bringing them in, giving them the chance to start, play at a Division One school with academics that are the, some of the best in the country. So when you combine all that, we've got a great product. Talking about your season, you have a team that's only scrimmaged themselves and here they go out to play their first season. What are your expectations? I, I tell you, it's uh, you really don't have anything to compare it to. We are going directly into a conference, into the Pioneer Football League. So we're going to be playing a lot of senior-laden teams with our freshmen. So those are going to be very difficult games. We have four non-conference games against lower-level teams uh, that hopefully we will be able to compete. Uh, early and gain some confidence so we can try to play play well in those uh, conference games. So uh, it, it's kind of a, a, the, the great unknown. Uh, you don't really know until you play a Drake. Like our first game will be in, in, against Drake uh, on September 28th within the Pioneer Football League. And Drake is known for having a big, strong football team. So we'll probably find out how good we are or how bad we are <laughs> on, on uh, the 28th when Drake rolls in here. But. We're excited about it, we're excited about the opportunity, but right now there's a lot of unknowns going into the season.